Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi. My Facebook and friends, peace be unto you all. I'm your humble servant, a humble and respectful brother. Well, this video is an advice that I want to give to all my African friends from any corner, from every corner of Africa, wherever you are, this advice goes to you. Okay. Please, I'm begging, I'm begging my f brothers and sisters, please, I know Africans, we love to travel, we love, we love to experience new things, you know, have uh, different challenges and stuff. I'm begging you, you know, please, if you're thinking about traveling or wherever you want to go, please, please, please be mindful with where you go. I'm begging you, be mindful with where you go. A lot of places are not safe. Please, do not go anywhere close to Syria. Please, do not go anywhere close to Syria. Do not go anywhere close to Iran. Do not go anywhere close to Afghanistan. Do not go close to anywhere close to Iraq. Okay, this is what happened last week to poor young men from Japan, journalists, I think both of them were journalists, went to Syria for and humanitarian reasons. I don't know what they want to do over there though. So they went down there. You need to see how these guys were slaughtered. You know, it was, it was crazy. It was crazy. These niggas kill anything that comes their way. You know, like they kill anything that comes their way. You know, I don't know what kind of God they have. But I feel like the God that they worship is a God of violence. The God that they worship is God that loves blood. Oh my God. They're killing a lot of innocent children. One of the journalists have um, a daughter who is three weeks old. This guy pleaded to just to see the picture of his daughter before he died. They didn't make him leave. I know for sure that he would love, he would love to see his pic, the picture of his daughter. They didn't give him an opportunity to do that. Please, if you are a soccer player and you get a contract going down there, do not go, do not sign the contract. I'm begging you. I love you guys. I want you guys to stay alive. You know, it's like, You have to be alive. You know, I'm begging you to be alive for you and your family. I know that we go places, you know, to go and hustle, to make ends meet and come and take care of the ones home. Yes, I understand, but please, Syria, Afghanistan, Iran, Iraq, a lot of places over there, it's not safe. I'm begging you, it's not safe. These people, I don't know which religion they came from, but I condemn them, you know, I condemn them. I'm praying, I'm praying that the God of the, the God, the God of the poor, the God of the weak people, the God of the unarmed people should help bring these people to bring these people to justice. You, you, this stupid coward killers. You say you are, you say you're strong. You know, when you want to do something and you believe that what you did, you have a courage, you have a boss to do that. I feel like you have to stand. This nigga is going to kill people, a lot of people, and start hiding inside holes like rats. You know, that is coward killing. You know, that is coward killing. You know, I don't know what reason they have. All right, man. I don't know what reason they have to be killing innocent souls. You love your family. 
you have kids that you want to be there for. Why would you want to hurt somebody's kids, somebody's family? You know, who, which religion do you belong to? Because you're definitely not Muslims. You are not Muslims. You are not Christians. You are not Jews. You are not Hindu. You are not Buddhist. You are just a murderer. You are a coward. So stupid. You know, you say you're very strong. Why won't you come out from the holes? Come out and fight. You know, come out and fight. You know who you want to fight against. Why will you be hurting a journalist, man? A taxi drivers, nurses, doctors. They're not there to hurt you. They were, there, they were just there to help the civilians over there who need help. You are just a blood sucker. The God that you worship is an evil God. He loves blood. He loves to see the innocent suffer. The Lord that I serve is the Lord of justice. The love that the, the Lord that take care of the rich and the poor equally. My love, the Lord that I serve is a merciful God. He doesn't want you to hurt nobody. Oh my God, where is God? Please, I need an answer to this. The God of the weak, please, they are hurting your people. The God of the poor, your people are dying. This, you know, these stupid dogs who don't value their lives, they see themselves as dogs. So they always think that whoever is around them is one of them. God bless the United States. God bless Britain. God bless any country that opposes them. I pray that all these evil men will one day come to justice. And these are the people that have to suffer. They have to die two, three times. They have to feel a triple pain before they die. They have to be begging to die. I know you will be brought to justice. The whole world hates you. Nobody likes you. Nobody likes you. You don't have a God. You are just a coward. I hope and pray that this video is going to get to you. Anyhow, whoever gonna, whoever going to forward it, whatever. But... You guys are evil, man. You guys are evil. Kidnapping people. Killing them. His daughter did not get the opportunity to say, Dad, good morning. She will know her dad by what her mom going to tell her. That she had, that your dad had been murdered by a vampires. By a criminal organization. By a terrorist organization, you guys are evil. My God will surely judge you. The blood of these innocent people that you kill will harm you, will haunt you. They're not going to kill you. They will make you suffer. They will make you suffer. You guys are not Muslims. You don't have a religion. You don't... May God have mercy on your souls. God bless the United States. God bless Britain. God bless Italy. God bless France. God bless Germany. God bless Japan. And God bless Ghana. Please, my brothers and sisters, Stay away from those countries. Do not go down there. Because these people even kill their mom and their dads. So don't go.
place. Whatever contract you get, you are a soccer player, you are a goalkeeper, you are a basketball player, please do not go down there. I'm begging you. Stay blessed and stay peace. Stay tuned for more videos, my brothers and sisters.